Ladies and gentlemen, it is time. The newest announcement for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet has just dropped. And uh, we're expecting some good stuff here. So I'm just going to record my live reaction. Uh, start a little discussion with you guys in the comments. Let me know what you guys think about this, what you've seen so far, what you see today. Um, for me personally, predictions, I'm expecting to either see uh, some evolutions of starters, box art legendaries, which is probably most likely. I'm sure we'll see... Um, the legendaries, but you know, you, you never know what Pokemon's gonna throw at you. So let's jump right into uh, this video. Looks like it's only three minutes long, but let's get let's get it, boys. Okay. Graphics looking kind of crispy. I like the. It's a Pokey gas station. Hold up. I, I like the region overall. How it's uh, like tropical. Damn, professors, what is up? Okay, there's the guys. As long as there's Fue Coco, I'm, I'm happy. Look at my dude. Okay, are we, gonna, are we about to see evolution? Hello? What is that? Are we gonna see a new evolution? <laughs> I doubt it, but. This looks way better than Legends Arceus, just because it's bright. We got Pikachu, of course. And we run it. So there's different... Oh, we got a little desert biome. Okay. A little different... Uh... Okay. Bun sweet looking thing. Interesting. Ground texture looking kind of ass, but that's all right. We'll let it slide. What is that? <laughs> It's a new pig, Lechonk. Damn, that boy is chonky. Okay, so it's like Tepig, <laughs> but different pig. Um, what's wrong with that Choodle? The Choodle looked different, right? What? So the Pokemon Center looks like a gas station. I'm into it. Is this the trading animation? Yeah, it's gotta be just trading. Larvitar for uh, Bagon, nice. Venonaut is back. Toxapex, Cragonal. We got Gengar out here. Levity with the sweet pants. Talonflame. Okay, this is intense. Show me 30. No battle timer on Wi Fi battles. Even 30 minutes would be a plus. Um, okay. Now's when they're giving it to us, boys. They got through the nonsense. It's coming. Whoa. Not actual game footage. What is this? Yep, box art legendaries. Hello? Is it Jet? Yo. Those dudes look sick as hell. Finally, Pokemon. Yo, the textures look amazing on that, by the way. What have we here? Scarlet and Violet exclusives. Um, those actually look really sick. November 18th. November best, best month ever because it's my birthday. Hold on. We gotta take a look at these fellas. Look at this guy. Like, you can see the scale. I mean, this is obviously not actual gameplay footage. But... Personally, I enjoy when, when Pokemon comes out with monsters that aren't so, I don't know, cutesy and like these ones look really cool. Look at these boys. Good lord. I mean, the one on the right is obviously cooler, right? He's like glowing and shit, but they're actually both pretty. They both have like a kind of Chinese looking, I don't, I don't even know how to describe it. Sick though. Look at my dude's eyes over here. They're like pixelated. What are we thinking for types on these things? They're like dragons, but like typing could go either way. This thing could be like part ghost on the right. I have honestly... No idea what to expect from these things. Like, it could be like steel. It looks like he's like kind of technology based over here. This one's like gotta be fire because of just the red. I, don't, I have no idea. Scarlet, violet, I don't know. Those things are sick though. Okay, so all we got box art legendaries, but 
that was pretty amazing. I honestly think we got to run through this one more time while we're here. Uh, just to just to try to take a second look at stuff that we may have missed. Um, we can take a look at like, even <laughs> there's, I'm sure there's very small things that I'm going to miss, but like there's Applin, uh, the freaking hat, Hatena. Every time we see a Pokemon revealed in this, shows that it's going to be, you know, in the game. So that's pretty nice. Fun fact, I think when we saw the Venonat, that was, uh, I'm pretty sure Venonat, ha Venonat hasn't been included in the National Dex in, like, the longest time. Venonat, they're finally showing love to Venonat, but, um, looking at, like, this Pokemon Center setup here, it straight up looks like a gas station. What does that even say? I have no idea. Um, 1080p. <laughs> Interesting. Interesting. Little Scarlet Violet type of uh, badge logos. The graphics honestly still look pretty underwhelming. I mean, there's really not a lot of texture or anything going on on the ground, but it seems to be a step up from Legends Arceus, which is fine because that game played perfectly fine. Professor Sata and Turo. Why they gotta make my boy so handsome? Also, Team Fue Coco, by the way, all day. I'm not actually kind of happy they didn't show the full evolutions of these things, just because it's kind of fun to not, to not know. <laughs> if I'm be real. Like, what is this guy? I don't, I don't know if I'm a big fan of this dude. It just looks like an ugly Eevee or something that like a child tried <laughs> to draw with the crown. Um, interesting though. I mean, it's just a, probably just like an early route bidu or something like that. But Fue Coco, on the other hand, is the goat. So this is something that obviously I didn't even talk about, but we can connect with friends and head on adventures together. We can play the game together. Finally, that's exactly what Legends Arceus needed uh, was some type of co-op, even if it's literally just running around catching stuff together, which I'm sure that is what it will be. But if they're also focusing on... Uh, you know, multiple player connectivity, that could mean that battles are going to be at the forefront. I mean, I'm sure since Legends Arceus and BDSP were kind of skipped battling, this generation will probably be the one that hosts like the VGC tournaments um, and like all the official battling. So we have high hopes for the battling in this gen, but that's amazing that you can actually play together. That's really cool. There's the friends right there. And they're just, you know, getting ready to run out. I was honestly just enjoying the graphics when I was watching this over the first time, but uh, we see the different biomes. Lit. I kind of like this little berry dude. As if we needed another guy like that. But that's Joe. <laughs> Weird little pig, homie. His name is Lechonk. He's only level two. So this is. It does show us a little bit of insight on the battle mechanics there, at least the view of kind of battling, which looked a little different than Legends Arceus. I wonder if, it, if it's going to be the same as running around like we did around the battlefield. I'm sure it probably will be. Um, interesting to show the focus on trading. Maybe showing some version exclusives there. Got the Venonat fields. Got freaking Colossals. Don't think I'm missing things in the background. You guys let me know if I'm seeing anything huge. Um, is that Mon using Dig? Hello? Alright, and then it's just going to run us into our legendaries. Um, so I think, honestly, pretty solid trailer. I would have liked to see, like, maybe one more big thing revealed other than box art legendaries, but they did give us a couple new Pokemon. Um... So, I mean, also, if this is how the game looked, count me in, but, like, why do they just have to CGI us all this, all this shit? Interesting jets there. So it could be, like, a flying steel. I don't know. It looks like a freaking cyborg. I have no idea what the homeboy, homeboy on the left is going to be. But I really like these guys. I mean, generally, the box art legendaries do look just, like, cool and appeal to, like, strong Pokemon trainers, but, like... I think they did a good job with these guys. The box is looking sick. And I'm buying Pokemon. I'm buying. I wonder when we're going to get next. Uh, our news next. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for today's video. Let me know what you thought in the comments uh, about this trailer. If you enjoyed it. Uh, if you think that it was lackluster. Just let me know. Uh, also, if there's anything that I missed, let me know down in the comments. And uh, I will see you guys soon. Peace out.